that my that my website is called what the hell did you say <laughs> so you are about to find out why okay awesome <laughs> So I, w I already watched the film and I love it. Awesome. H how did you get this inspiration? You know, five years ago I read a newspaper article about a man who had returned home from the war and he was struggling with post-traumatic stress disorder. And at the time, you know, nobody was talking about people coming back from the war and the hardships that they were facing. I mean, there was like a lockdown in the news, you know, you didn't even see coffins yeah. of soldiers that, that had been killed in the war. And so when I read this article about this man whose life had fallen apart, it really struck, uh, you know, struck me on a deep level. And um, I just thought it was a really, just an ultimate tragedy that he had served his country honorably and then came home and everything fell apart. So I spent two years doing research and just trying to understand what it was like for soldiers coming back from the war. And what I realized, sadly, was, was that this was happening more and more often. Um, so I decided at a certain point I wanted to write a script and, and hopefully bring more light to, to some of these issues. Well, I love the movie. Thank awesome. you so much. And since we are tight on time, would you mind saying something in Spanish for the camera? Oh my God. Donde esta el baño? Ah, perfect. <laughs> That's the best one.